everyone. Welcome back to ToyNotes.com. Make sure you hit that subscribe button because we're taking a virtual reality experience and you're not going to want to miss it. So today I'm unboxing and playing with the Samsung Gear VR. I just saw a commercial for this today and it said give the gift of VR with Samsung you know for the holidays coming up and everything. This is going to be compatible with Samsung phones like the Note 7 and the Note 5 to name a couple of them. Um, the other ones it says is uh, Galaxy Note 7, S7, S7 Edge, Note 5, S6 Edge, S6 and the S6 Edge Plus. So if you didn't catch all of that, you can always look it up with the Samsung Gear VR. But those are the ones that it says it's compatible with. It's not going to be compatible with just any phone because Samsung is definitely trying to push their brand. So lucky for me, I have a Note 5 already. So I'm going to plug it into this and we'll see how it works. First though, got to get it unboxed. So let's go ahead and do that and then we'll play. All right, so super easy unboxing. One piece of tape, and I just clipped that off, and then your Samsung Gear VR is right here. Um, obviously, you're gonna wanna remove all this plastic before you use it, but looking at it firsthand, it's nice that they have this kind of very soft microfiber material um, for around your face and your eyes. And then, of course, they've got the instructions in here as well as head straps, which you will also need to install. So the head straps are Velcro closures, and then we've got a micro USB connector and some sort of connection port here. So I think I'm gonna need my instructions just to make sure I'm doing this right, and I download the correct app to my phone, because in order for it to work with this, from what I understand, you usually have an app that goes with it. So let me go ahead and do that, bring you guys in, and then let's have some fun with this. So guys, before we do playtime with the Samsung Gear VR, I just wanted to show you what it looks like kind of up close so you could see. Now along the side here, you're gonna see this touchpad. That's how you interact with everything. There's a home button and a back button, as well as um, up and down for volume control. The top here is your kind of fine focus for when you are in the gameplay. And then this is where your phone goes. You kind of can unclip this and then you can see the glass in there. Um, the phone would go here, it plugs into the micro USB um, or there's an attachment in the box also if it doesn't fit your phone to go into a different kind of um, port. Once that's in though, you have the head straps that you have to put on, and then you've got this nice kind of foam around the eyes, nose, um, and then these are Velcro adjustable. So I just want to show you really quick what it looked like up close so you could see, and then I wanted to take you guys along for the ride because I'm going to go ahead and plug my phone in this and actually play with the Samsung Gear VR. So now that my Gear VR from Samsung is on, you are going to have to download the Oculus app obviously and then you're going to have welcome to oculus home up here in the top there you have several options you can this is the home page you can buy more uh, vr content or view the library of content you've already downloaded over here and i'm turning my head to actually look at this this is not a screen i'm just sharing with you what i actually see when i'm wearing the vr uh, here you've got that store again, Samsung Picks, and some featured content that's free. You can purchase content or you can play content that is free on here. Um, however, the video doesn't allow me to record the content on here. You actually have to go get yourself a Samsung VR to experience it. So there's games like this one here, the fishing game, um, a lot like... Uh, you know, a reward game, you catch a certain fish, you can trade it in for points and get things. Um, this is a flying experience and the optional roller coaster. And then this one was like going through the rainforest and different outdoor settings um, with the Discovery Channel. So that's kind of what the screen looks like. There's a touchpad along the side. 
you can see this is the stuff that I have downloaded here in my library. You can sort it A to Z if you had a lot of content. Um, and all in all, it's just a pretty easy thing to wear and to use. And when you look down on the floor, you see the pillows, a little uh, moat here. I mean, you just look all around the room. This is all behind me to my left. And then if I look off to my right, that's behind me to my right. You can look up. See all the stuff up there. And then right back into the home screen. So I hope you guys enjoyed our closer look together and coming along for the ride with our Samsung Gear VR. I had a lot of fun playing with it. I think this is a great VR system for an entry level player. There's a lot more out there that definitely beat this out in terms of quality and usage. I feel like Samsung really limits their market by having it to just a few phones and Samsung devices only. But I do like that they are concerned about the comfort of the journey um, and that you can buy more content and you can use your phone. I literally pulled this out of the box and used it in a matter of minutes, so that was pretty nice. The adapters here are great depending on what the port looks like on your phone. And they even included that little white one I showed you so that you can outsource it to a television or a laptop. So that's pretty cool. Um, I would think this is better if you use it with a pair of earbuds or earphones like I did. It's a more immersive experience. And I was a little bit bummed out to see that Samsung didn't include anything like that with this. But again, it's pretty basic. It's a pretty entry-level VR system. So guys, if you want to be here for more Toy Notes videos and more awesome videos with these new VRs that are coming out, make sure you stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button and give us a big thumbs up. Also, check out ToyNotes.com. I'm there on my website, and there's a lot more content there. Lots of toys, lots of stuff to do, and lots of playtime. So until next time, see you soon.